Hello everyone, this is Crossfire Kitty and I'm playing a Plague Tale Innocence. We are on chapter 16 and then after that there is a prologue. So I have already played through it just to make sure I know everything is. And um, in general the chapter is okay. But there is one particular moment that is just kind of a pain in the butt. Mostly to do with the fact that when you try to auto-aim, which the game only does, it only auto-aims, you can't do it freely. Um, sometimes the thing refuses to actually lock on to your target. So we're going to do the best we can and hopefully everything will not be too annoying. If you enjoy, please let me know and please subscribe, comment, like, and all that good stuff. So let's begin. 16... And it is called Coronation. It's huge! How are we going to find Mummy? We'll get her out of there, Hugo. Right, that's enough hanging around. Hey, wait! I'm really sad. She'll be alright. But... Can't we help her? That's why we're here. To help her get revenge. And to keep her alive. We got the kid and the rats. We're invincible. Roderick, he's five years old. It would be nice if we were invincible, but not quite. If only. What's the matter? Melly, calm down. Those fucking rats blocked the safest entrance. They didn't mean to do it, Melly. They... We don't have a choice. We have to try the great door. But watch out. Okay, you're in the way. Melly, wait! Is she angry with me? <laughs> no. She's just angry full stop. But... Give her a little time, Hugo. I'm a little busy, cat. She... Make sure we get supplies. Let me check my thing. Uh, I don't have enough for anything at the moment. Watch out. Okay. There's gonna be a little cutscene. Hey, do you think it's already started? I hope so. Because there's more and more of them around here. Three. It's risky. Dallas knows what he's doing. Tonight We're better off using the back door. That's what he says. Chances are it's locked. They're going. In the shit hole. We don't even know what's really Three is going. not really that risky compared to what we've move. done before. Follow me. Cat, I cannot pet you right now. Have faith. In the meantime, we have a job to do. Right. I'm going back. Be careful. You can sit here. Oh shit. They'll be seen. But I'm not petting you right now. Stay there. Hey. No, no. Stop. Don't I want you over you. here. Stay here. You can sit there. Thank you. I hope they make it. She knows the town. She'll lead them a dance. Come on, we have to take advantage. I don't have any food over here for you. I had candy, but it's gone. The cat seems to think I have food for her. I don't have food. Is there anything over here? I don't think so. I didn't look over here before. Just making sure. Alright. Supplies. There's a cart over somewhere. It's changed a lot since last time. The bells, the cathedral, Amicia. That's where Vitalis is. Which means Mother mm. is too. That bastard's gonna get a surprise. First, we have to find. I the can't others. go over there. Okay. Anyway, there's a guy over here and a cart. One of those special carts. The cart. You don't need to tell me twice. Yep. Go ahead. Ooh. Nothing over there. Thank you. Good job. Good job. I would like to have been on the end of that. Yep, yeah, I'm glad that you think you're great. Did I just knock him off? Oh, sorry. 
He just kind of disappeared. Okay. Um. We have enough for an ammunition bag. And we're missing eight of, whatever, or seven of whatever those things are. They look like chicken planks, but they're not. And then six of the powder stuff. I guess I'll go ahead and do that. Huh. This should make things a little easier. Eh, maybe. You can hold more rocks now. Can't go over there. Well, I mean, I guess we will be able to go over there in a moment. As long as I get some supplies. What's that shaking? It's the rats. They're here, beneath us. So they're the ones who destroyed everything. Look at the ground. Okay. Oh. Wow. You say, Roderick, stay close to us. Are you sure? Yes. They're listening to me. Wow. Okay. So we're gonna go back here and get the collectible. And some supplies. Over here is the item in question of the curiosity. I wouldn't touch that if I were you. Why? The flagellants whip themselves with it. It's probably got bits of flesh in it. Oh, I see. And that item is... This one. Called Discipline. Okay. There's a gun with that guy. Yep, he's definitely dead. Alright. Alright, so rats are having fun. Leave anything for us? Yeah, let's make sure we got the stuff we need. I gotta watch out because there's a um, archer up there. That guy is annoying. Okay. I don't think I can hit him from here. Okay. What's that? Pepper. Oh, it'd be nice of down. The Lord will strike you down. Okay. Nothing nothing either. Or keep looking. What? There. Get there. Yes. Gotcha. That's what I meant to do. <laughs> I'll show you how we handle little bastard. Oh god. I knew it. Be careful of that guy cuz he'll shoot us with an arrow. I'm actually surprised he didn't shoot me. Right, did the other guy get you know? I think the other guy might have gotten in. I don't see him anymore. Alright, I think we're good. Now I just gotta wait for that guy to stop being obsessed with me. I say it's like here I don't have any problems. It's just when they're any distance away at all that the, uh, the aiming just goes really wonky. All done. Back to your path. All right. It's fine. It's, I think the other guy is gone. Uh, I can actually. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. This thing is just weird. Sometimes it will be very strange. Oh, you're still alive. I thought you were dead. All right. He's probably back to his usual spot, which is over here. So we should be able to get him with... Yeah. Can you take care of him? You're going to pay. Ooh. All 
Alright, so we're gonna get some supplies. Everybody should be taken care of. And there's a guy down the alleyway, but we'll get to him in a moment. First, we wanted to try to make sure we take care of um, these. Make sure we have any rats we need. We don't need to get all the rats, just we get a couple. I think that's enough rats. I don't want to use all my supplies just making, uh, taking more rats out. And you'd have to put the fire out to do that, so. I think we have enough rats. I mean, they have quite a few, they have a several sources, not quite a few. They have several sources here, I guess. Or at least a couple. So one, two, we got those rats. Um, all right, we're gonna go up there. There's actually tools up there, I believe. Anything over here? It's like I haven't really gone over here. Okay. Why do I keep thinking I'm seeing stuff? Oh, there I go. <laughs> like I'm walking by all the supplies. I'm good at that. I'm good at just missing the supplies. All right, there's a tool. I don't know why it's there, but okay, that's it. So we got the fire um, snuffer. And you can do it all the way from here, actually. Um, okay. It was like he was at the edge of where they would go, almost. Right. Hopefully we didn't miss any supplies, but... If not, it doesn't matter. We're going on. Get the rock. You take that guy, I'll take this guy. Let's go. I wish I was strong like that. Mate, you have an army of rats. Roderick, do we have to open this? Uh, I yep. see a lever. I'll take care of it. On your mark. I don't know oh. how they opened it, but... It? Rock. Alright, oh. That. Roderick, you're up. Yeah. Whoa. Come on, throw. Quickly. Look out. Uh, get the fire out of there. Get the rats out. Get the rats. Luckily for us, armor does not really do much against the rats. Unless they have fire. I'm not sure what that guy's doing. But they didn't see us, they're just like, what's going on? Yeah, don't go over there, guy. And there's an archer over there, too, I think. I think I can get their armor off with this now. Okay. Yeah, watch out for that archer. Can I get him from here? I guess so. Alright. Can I get you from here? Oh, he's hiding or something. He's like, nope, can't get me. Can't even see him. I, mean, I kind of see him, but... Yeah, sometimes it just wants to slide around. Jake, where are you? That's my biggest problem. It like, doesn't always want to log on, lock on. Of course, in this case, I'm pretty far away, so that makes more sense. But even then, sometimes it doesn't want to. I actually worked that time. Surprised. All right, let's look around and get the supplies. Yes, Melly, Mel, not Melly. Yeah, Melly's here. That's right. Melly and, um, oh, Lucas, right. That went fairly well. Nothing there. This way. Rocks, I need those. Yes. Amicia, you're alive. Yep. Listen, Vitalis is at the cathedral. That's all very well, but the whole battalion is coming our way. You need to get 
get out of here. Okay. Take the stairs. The house is an exit on the other side. Um, the one that's on fire. We can't go back. Go. We'll meet you on the other side. Be careful. Come on. The house. Make sure we have enough of everything. Okay, we don't need a pot. Oh, we don't need that either, apparently. <clears throat> Alright, I think the main thing is we got um, all the rats out. Too bad you can't hit them with pots. you think you would be able to hit the soldiers with the pots, but... So we need the rocks. Since we have... Yeah, since we have um, all the rats out. Um, I guess I can do this just in case. I don't know that I'll need that one, but just in case. Okay, so let me see if I can open the door. Ah, locked. I'll break it down. He'll try to break it down. I'll get rid of the guys out here. They'll come from that direction. You see. And that direction. Some guards are coming. Roderick, take cover. We'll have it when Hugo. Have fun. Get over here, guys. Oh, I wasn't sure if they got through or not. Alright, is it is that it? Okay, so just that guy. So we gotta get rid of his fire. You can do it while he's on his way. Will the rats get him? Uh not sure. Uh, I'm gonna wait for him to get in the middle of the rats, maybe. Well, actually, can he go? Ah! Well, if I hit it. Ah! There we go. That could have been a little better, but that's fine. Could have been a little better. And I had wasted my stuff. That's right. So we're gonna go over here and get the collectible, which is a flower. Which is the Christmas flower. Christmas rose, it's called, I believe. I keep bumping the table. Let me see a look. Even though it's black. Or very dark purple. I'm not sure. Okay, where is the... there it is. Uh. It survived all this? Yes. It's a warrior. It defends itself. It's like us then. That's right. Thank you. It's your flower. Thank you, Hugo. Let's go. So, um, I changed their clothing because, um, I, when I went back to the menu, menu, I was just wondering why it seemed like Hugo wore an outfit that was not the thing that I picked. He wore that, um outfit that we got from the old lady and whenever I changed it back to the original one I had it put him into this even though he's been wearing that orange thing from the second chapter or whatever it was he just suddenly decided that he could wear the actual clothing that I picked for him so that's why he's not wearing that thing he was wearing before I bet anyone even cares maybe nobody cares All right, so let's go through the door. Does anybody have anything for us? Any of the people that are being eaten? Actually, I think I did that already, didn't I? Yeah, I think I did. All right, I think we're good. Just in case. Oh, there's one. Yes, I did miss one. Miss that too. All right, we need that stuff. Some plan. No, Monsieur, we can't. We'll be burned alive. Nothing will happen to you. I okay. promise. Roderick, are you with us? To hell and back. <coughs> I'm glad supplies are everywhere. <coughs> be careful. Can you take care of it? Yeah. <coughs> oh, it's just okay. I'm coming. I'm coming. She's gonna hear it. <coughs> well, I guess we better leave then. Hugo, you be the captain of the Inquisition. <coughs> You're a tough guy. Tougher than I am. Really? I never lie. 
Um, yeah, <laughs> you might bend the truth, though. Can you do it? I'm on it. Okay. As my father used to say, <laughs> it's fire that forges the punishment. <laughs> this must be the exit. <laughs> Not really smoke in here. I mean, not as much, anyway. Only two shots so far. Pretty calm for a day okay. of miracles. So he'll take out that guy. Come on me. I gotta make sure I got rocks. Well done. I might have got a little carried away. Gotta make sure I got this guy. Not his lantern. It's like it's constantly wanting me to go to his lantern. This Told you I catch you. I'm so annoyed by this stupid fucking game. Only two cars so Pretty calm for a day of miracles. Okay. Can you take care of him? You're going to pay. Good job. He won't be getting up anytime soon. Trust me. Watch out. You are the only one who to ride on this car. This place. What do you think you're doing down there, huh? Hello? I actually hit him. I can't believe it. Sometimes it just completely misses when you do that. Okay. I don't need that. Um. Okay. Still don't need that. Alright, we're good. Try to get the things before I make those guys get activated because that's where it actually saves. If you get killed, those guys, um, I'm trying to avoid activating them for a second. So that way I can get this stuff. Because if not, you have to you have to collect it every time. <laughs> every time something goes wrong, you have to recollect it. I think that's all we can get. We can't go in there. So as soon as you go forward, then they have a cutscene. Oh, good. We don't have to reactivate oh, that thank stuff. You. Thank you. You can't God avoid them, you. so yes, thank you. They get shot. Good luck. Hey. I don't know why they're going that way. I mean, well done, men. Keep your eyes open. No yeah. one must approach the cathedral. There's the a cathedral. gate over there. Where do they think they're the going? Right that, the Pocus. It's the only way or to the cathedral. Pocus. We must find a way to cross. Uh, we have enough for this container. And this one we're missing three, one, and one. So. You know what? I'm just gonna do that. I'm just curious if I could get the other one upgraded. In the meantime, we'll go over to... Um... Rod Roderick's old place. Which is the here. Chain. You... You shouldn't. Why? This place. I know it all too well. What is it, Roderick? Roderick, yeah. Unfortunately, when you get killed, or when I get killed, um, and resets, it makes it so that you never went back there. So I'm just going back there once. This alleyway. Uh, no. I knew it. Roderick, what's going on? Where are you going? Let's go. It can't be. Roderick. There's nothing left. Did they burn your house down? It was my father's forge, where I grew up. It's where... I know how you feel, but you're still alive, and your roots, they can never take that away from you. <laughs> you're right. I know who I am. Come on. We have to save your mother. You'll see. Mummy's lovely. We'll go together, and we'll find another castle. Fine by me. Okay, we got rocks. That's good.
The cart! Roderick! If we push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. This is... I'm pushing. The Roger, most yeah, annoying yeah. part in the game, it's other Roger, than the last boss fight. Keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. You can't save him, unfortunately. Don't worry about me, kid. I tried. But... I actually shot the archers, but every time you shoot the archers, then another archer just shows up, so... And you then cannot fight the guy you have to really fight, which is the arch the soldiers showing up. Soldiers! Soldiers ahead! So... They're all yours! Thanks. Actually, yeah, I'm surprised. You want to do it before they go down the steps if you can help it. Just because then they don't have to worry about the aiming being weird. Okay. The problem is, is that sometimes it wants to aim at the wrong person. Like it wants to aim at the one that's furthest away instead of close. Instead of closest. Actually, I didn't think that would work. It's just really annoying. The cart! Roderick! If we push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. Hi, Roderick. Don't worry about me, kid. Soldiers! Soldiers ahead! Amicia, they're all yours. Thanks. No. Thank you. I don't know what it is, but whenever it expands, it doesn't seem like it hits on this right as well. I don't know if they can hit me here. I need to go ahead. We needed to reach the bot gullies. Okay. No, I don't want to throw the rock. Push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. Hi, Roderick! Don't worry about me, kid. I keep thinking he's saying hi, Roderick, even though he's saying hi, Rod Roderick. I mean to throw Roger, a rock. Leave the cart, please. No. Okay. We need to reach the bot gullies. Stuff. Oh, they have a lot of rocks on here. Didn't realize there was that many rocks. Amicia, they're behind us. Bastards! You bastards! I've reached the stairs. Come I wasn't quick. sure if I'd hit them or not. <laughs> 
the fuck? It would fucking work. The cart, Roderick. If we push it to the port, Callis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey. Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. Stop. All right, let's do this. Hi, Roderick. Don't worry about me, kid. Like, I, the aiming on this is so. Excuse me. The aiming on this is so aggravating. It's like it just seems like I didn't mean to do that. It just seems like it's so inaccurate. The last guy usually stops because he's an archer. It's mainly these two guys. For some reason, it's really hard for me to aim at them sometimes. Not all the time, but... I don't want to fucking use that! Goddamn! If it would fucking work... The cart! Roderick! If we push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. Hi, Roderick! Don't worry about me, kid. These guys are a pain. These guys are just annoying. Okay. God fucking damn it. If the fucking thing would actually goddamn work. If we push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. Hi, Roderick! Don't worry about me, kid. I'm trying not to get hit <laughs> by the arrows. <laughs> Reach 
the stairs. Come quick. Oh, what the... <sighs> I am not fucking going on until I hit goddamn fucking all of them. What the fuck? The cart! Roderick! If we push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. Don't worry about me, kid. Soldiers! Soldiers ahead! Amicia, they're all yours. I'm not sure that was aiming. Come quick! Don't worry. These are the ones that are really annoying. Sometimes it hits them and sometimes it doesn't. I am fucking done with this fucking game. Roderick, if we push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, <laughs> let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. Hi, Roderick! Don't worry about me, kid. No, I don't want to do that. Uh -oh. Is wrong with this goddamn fucking game? The cart, Roderick. If we push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. Hi, Roderick. Don't worry about me, kid. Soldiers! Soldiers ahead! Amicia, they're all yours. Please! No! Ah! We 
We need it to reach the Potkalis. This is so bad. I don't know why, but it's just really bad. Run, run, run. Okay. Oh, I finally made it without actually getting hit by those guys and without using a sleeping potion. It took me like seven times. Why? Because every time it would just not work. <laughs> We're, we're here. Come on. You guys leaving? Come on, quick. Oh my god, Roderick. I'm a bit better. Sorry. I'm right. Yeah. Behind you. All right. All right, well, while you're behind me, I'm going to go into a cutscene. I guess he'll go and join his father in the sky or Hugo, whatever. Come on, we have to go. Can't be happening. Melly, please. No. Those bastards have to pay. I'll make them pay. Our priority is to stay alive and stay together. That's why Roderick and Arthur sacrificed themselves. Just leave me alone. She's right, Melly. Roderick. He's gone, Hugo. He's resting now. I can't take any more of these bloody rats. But they're going to get us too. Really? How? Like this. How do you? Wow, it's it's really happening. Oh, my God. 
you guys not stand right there where they can see you. That would be great. I don't think they can see them unless they see me. Okay. Gotta be careful. There's the knights, or not the knights, the archers. Okay, I don't know if they're seeing me or. They don't see me yet. Trying to get that, but it didn't work. That shouldn't make any noise. Okay. Run over here. As long as they don't see me, they won't see them, I think. Hopefully. I'm trying to get this without getting killed because if we get killed, then it'll start. It'll start in a part that I don't want it to start in. Okay. Get that other archer. Takes a little bit longer, but I just want to make sure I get. Make sure they don't see us. I'll we'll get that guy over there, hopefully. Alright, he's over there again. What? You go to his. <laughs> Thank you. I love the auto aim when it goes to the wrong thing and you have to drag it away from where you don't want it to be. Well Alright, let me go Those collect some stuff. Rats, eh? Now they did that, let me get some rocks. Now if I get killed, at least it will start on the platform once I get up there. But I didn't want to have to re... I didn't want to just start up there unless I actually reached up there. If you get killed anywhere that's even close to it, they'll automatically put you up there with everybody back. Oh, I was getting a little aggravated. See if I can find some rocks. I'm not sure if I can, but oh, I think there's some on the platform. And there's one last collectible I'm going to get. Which is down below. Down over here is the last collectible. The Inquisitor's manual. Are you serious? Yep. Is that your manual for this shit? It was written before Vitalis. And we're gonna make sure there won't be a second volume. Alright, so all we got is everything. That's the last one we just got. The manual. And this part up here can be a little annoying because sometimes Vitalis. Amicia, he's going to do something very bad. I can feel it. Well, bad. besides the boss fight. Like what? Excuse me, okay. but whatever he's up to, we're here to kill him, right? The main thing is to kill the archers first. He's about to start. Let's go, Hugo. Main he's thing is you want to kill the archers first. Because if not, they will kill you. <laughs> and they don't let you do it right away. Lucas! Meli! Stay where you are! So, I hear some children are asking for punishment. You'll die if you come down! That doesn't matter! Amicia, there are rats down there. So tell them to come out. Go on! Very well. I need to get rid of these archers. This is my deal. This will end badly. Now, get away! Okay. The best thing about these guys is that, um, they really can't do anything about it. Come back! Key. I'm gonna see if I can get some more rocks. Well, he's trapped. 
will strike you down. Okay, let me see if I can get him. Hey, can I get the rocks, please? Thank you. Huh. I would need to get this stuff. And really, there's lots of rats, so all you have to do is wait for them to come down. Because they um, will literally walk right into the rats. Oh, I need to shoot you. So, yeah, they'll do that. Let's go inside. Oh yeah, I got that. Yeah, I did. Okay. Some family. Millie. The boss fight can be really annoying, but I guess I'll edit it if I keep messing up. But at least this part, I don't mind as much. The other part was just driving me crazy, but I won't, I won't go into a rant about that again that I've already done like seven times to myself. I refuse. <laughs> yeah, you don't. Yep. My mom. Did Vitalis do this? He sacrificed them. He's past the threshold. Go get out of here! Oh, for pity's sake. I don't know why he's putting her up there, but... Are you ready? Yes. The rats are here. Yep. We can then get some go. supplies. Stay close to me. We're coming too. Where did I get that fox that's wrapped around me? I can't turn around. I guess I have to go forward. Let her go, Vitalis. This is your last chance. Yeah, you can't do anything here. Hugo, your power. Other than going forward. I'm fine. Don't worry. He's a very gifted student. Too bad he's forgotten who taught him everything he knows. Shut up, you old fool! We're here to kill you, not listen to your speeches! And yet, look at you. Walking yep. towards me like lost sheep to their shepherd. That's enough, Vitalis! You're alone! Give us back your mother or... Oh, what? Oh, exactly. what? Good question. I still have things to teach the carrier and his friends. <laughs> you're so touching. Thank you. Uh, you're Thank welcome. Thank you for your candor. Okay. Do you hear them? Yep. The angel. The angel rats. Yep. The angel of the new world. <sighs> Get back! The light, see? I saw it. Come on. Yeah, hurry up, Lucas. I don't want to lose you. Lucas, Melly, stay there. No, I can help you. How? It's our blood, Melly. All right. Yeah, what are you going to do? the supplies okay unbelievable yes well done Hugo we'll show him oh I forgot I have to um get rid of that with this DM you have come to challenge me I always forget about that Okay, go over there. You know nothing, but the macula knows everything about you. It's playing with you. Listen to him. 
That was a little close. A little close for comfort there. Okay. Oh, okay, I got it. I wasn't sure if I'd get that one. Just have to get up to the front. You go back. Thing can be a little aggravating. We're winning, Amicia. Yes, keep it up. You've lost. Lost. The rest of it, Dolly. Stop this. No. No. Another one. I think once you get the fire, I'll be careful though. Alright, this is a hard part of the boss fight. So I might have to restart a couple of times, but, or they'll make you when you die, but yeah, we'll see. Uh, that's a bad idea. Cool. I'd like to go over there, actually. Hugo, you feel it too, don't you? It scares you. The true power. The gift of self. Every time I do this, I have to do it several times because it's just a pain and I'm not good at it. I mean, he does a pattern. I just have problems with it. Oh my god, I hate the kid's voice. It is so annoying. Return to your master. Not my Come back! We grew! You know, it'd be nice if the targeting would actually work. The, ar the auto targeting that they make you use. That would be great. You know, if it would actually work. So that whenever you're auto targeting a character's head, you know, would actually hit it. That would be great. I mean, what is the point of him having auto targeting if the auto targeting doesn't actually work 50% of the time? I would just love for it to actually work. You know, that would be great. How about hit him in the actual You stop moving your friggin' head. This is your last affront. I sacrificed my flesh to become the crucible where everything unites. You cannot kill. Okay, I got it. Thank you. I'm just trying to keep him over here. Oh my god, I hate his voice. It's just great. It's great team. We shall be as one. Soon they will join us. You son, you go hit him. I can't because they're in the way. But is he actually gonna get there? I can't believe it. Can't believe it actually worked. Finally. After like the fifth time. Cause I love it. Every time I would try to hit the guy in the head, auto-aiming 
would make it completely miss and go right over his head. Here's an idea. The person who made this game was it a Sobi? If you make a game with auto aiming, make sure it actually works. It's over. Especially when you can't turn it off. God, I hate this. I... The game is neat. The game is cool. I just think the auto aiming is crap. Just make it so I can turn it off. But they don't let you do that. So this is chapter 17. It's kind of like the prologue. It's called For Each Other. Just got something from this lady. Give her some money. And according to their story, it's been... Let's go. Have you got everything? Yes, that's all Lucas asked for. Is Mommy going to get better with this? She will be all right, Hugo. Mommy is tough, isn't she? Just like you. That's right. I can't wait for us to find a new castle. Well, <laughs> you've got the taste of a king now. We'll see what we can do. We have to leave the region first. According to their story, it's been three days since this stuff all stopped. Three days since the rats disappeared. I don't know why they chose three days. Maybe it's some kind of significance that I don't know. But to me, that sounds pretty stupid. But that's all right. Not going to rant because every time I start restart this chapter, this part, I start ranting about things that don't matter because I didn't write the story. I'm going to let it go. However, they do have fresh meat somehow. So, were you able to go home? Yes. The nest is still there, but it's empty. I can't believe the rats are gone for good. Let's hope they are. The rats have been out of their houses, except for their nests, for only three days, but she moved back in. Oh, Amicia, Hello. look! Huh? You want to try your hand at shooting? Not me. My sister's really good. Right, Amicia? Yep. Also, somehow they have apples that look relatively fresh. I looked it up, and maybe things were different back in the day. Maybe they had ways of preserving them. But apples generally don't get picked after November at the latest. In fact, I'm pretty sure they said, said October was the latest. But now it's February, and somehow they have really fresh apples. All right, let's have a go. Good, good. The rule is simple. You have six stones, six possible shots. Try and shoot as many targets as possible. Are you ready? Yep. Oh, I guess I should ready. get the rocks. On, and birds. And also, I never really noticed this before until I start shooting this last little bit here. Why is there a shelf on the outside of his house? I guess that's his house. I have no idea. But do they generally put shelves on the outside of their houses? And why am I being why am I so nitpicking on it? I don't know. I just don't understand why there's a shelf there. Hey, you know how to do it. You want just an apple. Weird. I know, due respect. <laughs> Yep, here's the these apples magical you apples. You're my biggest supporter. Oh, thanks. I was hungry. Yep. As always. You're always hungry. Today we're celebrating the third day without rats. Third day, yep. There's a little fair down the street. Go take a look. A fair? A real fair? I've never seen a fair before. Hugo, Lucas is waiting for us. We should be getting back. Mm -hmm. But it's a fair. Come on. Hugo. <laughs> All right. But we can't stay long. But there will still be empty houses. If the bite leaves us in peace. People will come back eventually. At least not everybody's rushing back to the house after three days. Hey, look. Oh, that's the young boy. Oh, no. No, no, boy, you just can't come in. But why? Because you can. That's why. So there's no other young boys running around with a sister anywhere. 
That's cute. This pig looks fine. I guess they didn't kill all of the pigs. Hey, is there a problem? Look, the problem is a kid and his sister are wanted around here by important people. And we, well, we, we just don't want any trouble here. You understand? I can see very well. Uh huh. Hugo, we have to go. And where are these people that are supposedly looking for us? Come on. Well, there's a house that was on fire, apparently. I didn't really look at that one before. Hi. What are you doing? Hey, Hugo. What? What are you doing? To arrive at the cart wins 20 apples. He 20 apples? Yeah, you can go. I'm You'll looking over here. Me. Right, Slug? Yeah. You see. Oh, yeah? Then on three. One. Two. Three. Hey. <laughs> There's no point in racing him when you can't beat him. I don't I don't want to race. I'm going to go slow. I don't feel like racing because I can't beat him anyway. So could you stop doing this weird walk where you look like you're trying to run even though I don't want you to? Yeah. Apples covered with snow. Now one last thing. I looked up this thing. I don't- I didn't look up the cabbages because I'm pretty sure they don't grow in the winter. Um, turnips? I have no idea when turnips grow. Are those turnips? I'm not sure. Cabbages, I don't think they grow in the winter. It's February. In most places, I think that's considered winter. I looked up pumpkins and they said they grow in the fall. The fall is not February. At all. You know, it's like October. I don't know why they have pumpkins growing in the middle of winter. They wanted to have life growing, but they wanted to show that life was coming back. Why didn't they just make it spring? That would have made a lot more sense to me. But I am not going to restart this video again, so I'm going to try to calm down. Ready to leave this place? All right, all right. You won. Yes, 20 apples. All right, let's go. We made it, Lucas. Do you have everything? The St. John's what? Yes. The Hawthorne, the, all of it. Let's go. Good. Amicia? Yes? Why are they looking at me like that? Melly looked at me the same way. Then she left. Why? Because you're a weirdo. I don't know. Hugo, she... She had other things to do. That's not true. But it doesn't matter. You don't know her. I mean, she did have other, th other things to do. Is she going to sleep much longer? She has to get her strength back. With the herbs you bought, she'll soon be back on her feet. All right. All right. Well, we're moving on, I guess, to um, the second game. I guess, um... Hey, you go. What? Do you think I'm pretty? <laughs> You're ugly. Really ugly. <laughs> <gasps> ugly? Me? You look like a big fat fly. <gasps> a fly? Your own sister? Oh, such a slur requires punishment. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. <laughs> so I think they're going towards the... I thought I saw water, but I'm not sure now. This isn't the first time I've recorded this ending, so... I think the sea is out there. Looks like it. So they're gonna go to the ocean and travel somewhere, I guess. I think. I can't see it very well. Yeah, I think that, all right, it does look like the ocean, or at least, that, that's what it looks like to me. So they're gonna get in the boat, maybe, and travel to a new land, and start a new life, maybe, and find a new castle. I mean, you know, I'm sure there's a castle somewhere they can move into, right? I mean, isn't that where they're living at the beginning of the next game? I'm not sure. But, I don't need to see the credits. Yeah, thank you. 
he says they say thank you for the family, uh, the members, of the people that made the game, and all that stuff. Alright, so now that the game is over, I have, this is my like fourth time playing the game. I like the story in general. Um, there's just certain things I generally wish they had they would change. They're not going to change them, but one, I wish you could either turn off the auto aim or, or make it so it actually, you know, works. Because I feel like I would say 90% of the time it worked, but on the 10% of the times it didn't work, it was just a royal pain in the butt. When you have someone running at you and you're trying to shoot them with the um, rock and it just doesn't want to hit them. And you can't get rid of the auto aim. It's just a really annoying thing. Number two, I think it's kind of annoying that you cannot easily upgrade all your stuff in one playthrough. And since you can't do that, I mean, I guess maybe you can, maybe it's possible because I only had two upgrades left, so maybe it would have been possible that I could. And maybe I'm just really bad at, you know, being conservative on my use on the supplies by using them for um, ammo and stuff. So maybe I could have easily done it if I was just better, you know shooting people with my weapons but I just felt like the supplies were just really tight and in the second game I felt like I feel like it's even worse I mean even on the easiest setting I can never find enough supplies to upgrade stuff that's just the opinion I had at the time when I play it again maybe I'll have a different opinion and last of all why is there no new game plus games have new game plus there's no reason why this game doesn't have a new game plus. Then you wouldn't have to worry about it because you could just play the game again. You could just you could just say that um, certain things couldn't be unlocked. Um, like you can't upgrade, you can't unlock like the ability to throw fire until later. That I can understand, but they could make it so that the, at least the skills, like how much stuff you can hold in your pouch. There's no reason why that couldn't be in a new game plus. Like if you upgraded all the abilities to have all the stuff in your pockets. If you're doing a new game plus, you've already played the game through once. So it's not like you don't know what's going to happen anymore. But they don't have a new game plus. So I don't know why they don't. And that's pretty much the most, the things I find annoying about the game. Other than that, I think um, the visuals are cool. It's a sad when you lose a character, even though I wish that we could save them. But that's the way the story goes. So that's pretty much it. That's my thoughts on the game. There is a second game which I'll play. I'm hoping that maybe I can find some deeper meaning in it because the first time I played it, I've played it twice so far. It tends to be something I get to the end of and I go, why did they make this game? I don't really know. I'm not really sure who it's for. Other than, I, I just don't know. Because I don't feel like it really answers any real questions about where the bite is, why it came about. I don't, I mean, I just don't think it answers any real questions that you would actually be asking of the game. But maybe when I play it again, I'll go, oh, that's right. Now I remember now. That's what happened. This is how it happened. So I guess we'll see. Anyway, for the, for now, I'm done with this game, A Plague Tale Innocence. I don't know if I'll play the other one right away because I might need a break from Amicia and, and Hugo. Um, my favorite, one of my favorite characters, I like Lucas a lot. And I'm glad that he is in the second game. So that's, of course, a good thing. Um, I'm a little sad that you never see Melly again because I also liked her character a lot. But she's gone off to do her own thing. And other than that, I guess I guess we'll just go on to the next game. So if you enjoyed this, um, please subscribe, um, comment, uh, like if you want to, and um, let me know what you think of this game or even of the second game. In the meantime, thanks for watching. Take care. Talk to you later. And peace out.